Hey guys, welcome to the homestead. So about a year ago, there was a family who visited our homestead and they looked around. It was about summertime, just like it is now. And they were seeing these gigantic spider webs up in our trees everywhere. Some of them just huge. And they were like, something I got to know. How big is the spider that makes these webs? And I'm like, dude, they are huge. These are huge spiders. I mean, have you ever seen Lord of the Rings? Have you ever seen arachnophobia? Gigantic spiders. We have to, at night, we go in the house and we do not come out at all. And I mean, these spiders are gigantic and I mean, they will take your children away. So I'm just kidding, folks. I'm just kidding. I'm totally kidding. These are not made by spiders. And so uh, we had to tell her that. And uh, I just thought it was kind of funny later on. But these are actually bagworm nests. Uh, that are created and inside here there is just a bazillion not a bazillion but that's probably a little too much but a lot of worms and they destroy the trees and they're on the trees and last year we had a really mild winter and because of that mild winter um, there was this year this summer there's just they're all over the place and they're really attacking our persimmon trees our groves of persimmon trees but if you I'll, I'll zoom in check out this if you zoom in if you zoom in here you'll see all those worms look at that and they're kind of moving in there see them look at that and what you do these are actually great free food for your chickens so what you do is you cut these down like that let's see get them all moving in there what you do, you cut the branch down that they're on, and then you take these and you throw them to your chicken coop, and it's free chicken feed for your chickens. Look at that. All over the place. No, folks, there's not spiders that make these. There's no giant spiders. Um, but some people who aren't familiar with the Ozarks come out here, and they're like, dude, what is that in your trees, and how big is the spider that made that nest? <laughs> and so it's fun to have a little fun with people. So what I'm going to do is come in here, and I'm going to take this branch that you see here. Right, watch out for all the poison ivy around here. And I'm just going to cut off the branch. Just like that. And you see, there's a worm right here. I don't know if you can see that or not. Right there, crawling down the branch. And he's getting ready to be chicken food. Free chicken food. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to go towards the chicken coop. We have the branch full of all the good worms that these things are going to love to get a hold of go over here towards the chicken coop going down the path here's the chicken coop path and we're going to put it in the run of the chickens we're going to break it open for them here chick 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 now the guineas you see the guineas they won't like these uh we've never been able to get the guineas to eat them we got all kinds of guineas. look at all the 15 guineas we hatched this year Bunch of guineas. Woohoo! We love guineas because they eat all the ticks and chiggers on the homestead. All right, so here we go. So uh, I'm going to just leave this here. I'm going to break it open so that all the worms can escape. And what they'll do, they'll just take off a mad dash for uh, the sides of the chicken coop and they'll start moving along the ground and they will just go everywhere. Look at that. Look at that. They're just everywhere on the ground now. There. There we go. All over the ground. All over the ground there. Now let's back away and let the chickens come in here because they don't know what I'm doing here. They're like, what are you doing in our coop, dude? There you go. Look at that. They are eating that now. They're loving it. Loving it. Give me some more of them bagworms. <laughs> Free food for your chickens, folks. So every summer we get these things up in our trees and they are great ways to get free food for your chickens. They will absolutely devour these things. And these things, these bagworms are very destructive. We have to uh, go through and I mean, there's no way to cut them all down, but uh, you wish you could, you really wish you could. Um, but yeah, they are destructive and they're not caused by giant spiders, but they are a great opportunity to find free food for your chickens every summer. All right, we'll see you next time on an American Homestead. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please click the thumbs up button below the video. It really means a lot to us. 
and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Now you can support an American homestead by becoming a patron. Visit patreon.com slash an American homestead to see all the benefits of becoming a patron of our channel. You'll get access to private videos, pictures, and even live question and answer sessions that you can participate in. Some patrons will even receive free gifts throughout the year from the homestead. Visit patreon.com slash an American homestead to check it out and see the rewards of supporting our channel.